Hello, I'm Katie Brandt, uh, a SARE Partnership Program grant funded me to start the Michigan Sustainable Farm Mentors Program. And we were able to pair 42 beginning and aspiring farmers with mentors here in the state of Michigan. They mostly met online or by phone, by text, uh, but even with a small amount of time connecting with their mentors and with a peer, another mentee, um, we saw really big improvements in their work-life balance, their understanding of soils and financials, um, and we were also able to make uh, a toolkit for others who want to start a mentorship program. So we put together this poster for a conference here in Michigan um, to, to help people understand and be able to link to the, uh, the toolkit. And in that toolkit, what you'll find is the, the full grant that we wrote, which can be really helpful. Um, and then also resources that can go into any mentorship program. So the Google form that we use to allow people to sign up, the resources that mentors would use um, alongside their mentees in uh, figuring out like what resources does my farm already have um, in terms of people, in terms of tools and land, um, and what can I access in the future? And then goal setting and figuring out how to communicate between the mentee and mentor, um, and lots of prompts that were uh, dreamed up by the mentors themselves of how to keep conversations going. Those didn't prove as important because the mentees often know what they need. Um, <laughs> so they were often able to, to lead the conversations. So I just wanna give a big shout out to SARE, Sustainable Agriculture Research and Education for funding this project, supporting us along the way, um, giving us some extra time when we needed it uh, to, to get this project running and help farmers get started. In starting a mentorship, it was really important to be able to pay the mentors and give a stipend to the mentees. So finding funding sources, and that might be SARE, it might be uh, other grant programs um, is important. Um, but I think too, for beginning and aspiring farmers, look around you and think about who your mentor is already. Connect with them. Often people with experience and insight and wisdom love sharing it. And so don't hesitate to ask for help, whether that's, can you take a look at my website? Can you answer a question I have about this insect pest? Um, that's one thing I'd recommend for the beginning and aspiring farmers. For people who want to start a mentorship program, I have this toolkit that I mentioned. And in addition, um, I'm working on a beginning farmer or rancher development program grant to write curriculum for beginning farmer educators that also outlines uh, good practices for starting mentorships.